Things do not happen overnight. Rather, they require a great deal of skill and patience. Recently, with such enthusiasm, one persona has been able to achieve the golden buzzer in one of the most well-known reality TV shows, Britain's Got Talent. Yes, we're talking about Lorraine Allred, an American singer and composer. Want to know more about Lorraine Allred? Then watch the video till the end. But before that, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss any updates from us. Are you ready to know everything about Loren? Yes. Then without further ado, let's get into the video. For those who have no idea who Loren Allred is. Born on September 7, 1989, Loren Allred is an American singer, songwriter, and actress who made her debut on Billboard Hot 100 with her platinum-selling Never Enough. In terms of her personal life, the Pennsylvania native is the eldest daughter of Carol and Allred, a musician and Brady R. Allred, a musician. Coming from a musician family, Loren decided to study music at the Musical Theater at Weber State University. Later, she transferred to Boston's Berklee College of Music. If you have been wondering, how was Loren Allred discovered, then you must know. While she was in Boston, she used to upload videos to YouTube and was discovered by Neo ultimately leading to a record deal with Island Def Jam. That is when her musical career began. In fact, she had already tried at The Voice too. So, did Loren Allred win The Voice? No, Loren did not win The Voice. However, in 2012, for her audition in The Voice Season 3, Loren Allred sang When Love Takes Over by David Guetta. And yes, she was able to turn two chairs in the blind audition round. Despite this, she remained mostly unknown to the viewers until the knockouts round, due to both her audition and battle against Brian Scartacci, were not focused on the show's episodes. Nevertheless, she chose Judge Adam Levine. During the knockout round, her rendition of Amy Winehouse's You Know I'm No Good stunned both the judges and the audience. With her mesmerizing voice, Loren was chosen to move to live payoff. Unfortunately, her rendition of Lisa Stanfield's All Around the World did not receive enough votes, and she was eliminated from the competition. But this is not the end of Lisa's singing journey. She has even sang in various movies too. Now, let's look at Did Loren Allred act in The Greatest Showman? Even though Loren wasn't the actress in The Greatest Showman, she was the playback singer for the voice of Rebecca Ferguson's character. Her song was so popular and successful that both the soundtrack and Allred's song went platinum. In fact, Loren thinks that no one could ever play the role well as Rebecca did. We're sure you must be wondering, why did Loren Allred sing for Rebecca Ferguson? It was never a plan to sing, never enough by Loren Allred for Rebecca. As we mentioned before, after her tumultuous years in the music industry, following the voice journey, Loren needed a break. Loren opted to seek a career in the studio accompanied by her works. She was hired for one of the studio projects for a demo voice. Yup, guys you are correct. It was for the The Greatest Showman. Usually, the demo voice are used as a reference, but that wasn't the case here. Her angelic voice was loved by the Never Enough producers and the actress Rebecca herself. So, they decided to use the same voice for the movie. For Loren, it was an unexpected success, and, she is still going strong on her musical journey. What happened to Loren on Britain's Got Talent? Recently, Loren just auditioned for Britain's Got Talent. With her Never Enough performance, she stunned both the judges and the audience. Many of us have heard her song, but were unaware that it was Loren who was behind the amazing vocals. She felt more at ease singing behind the scenes at first, but now she believes she is ready to put a face to her music and that is why Loren was in BGT for a purpose. That clearly worked, as she received standing ovations from both the judges and the audience. Simultaneously, one of the judges, Amanda Holden, pressed the golden buzzer, sending Loren straight to the live session. We wish her the best of luck. Time to look at her love life. Is Loren Allred married? No, Loren Allred is not married yet. Rather, the American singer is still single and pursuing her music career. If you're wondering if she's dating someone, that's also not the case either. 
Like any other celebrity, Loren loves to keep her private life in shadows, which is why she has never addressed a guy in her life. As soon as we uncover more about her relationship, we'll let you know. It's time to reflect on her fortune, as she had spent the majority of her life pursuing her singing career. Last but not the least, we will be talking about How much is Loren Allred's net worth? As of today, the 32 years old Loren has been able to garner a net worth which is well above a million dollars. Most of her income comes from her career as an American professional singer. The stunning singer has over 370k subscribers on her YouTube channel, where she uploads her music videos and official albums. So, her YouTube channel will almost certainly bring in some extra cash. Nevertheless, from the brand promotions on her social media accounts, she makes some sort of income too. However, her major income is from the live stage performances and her selling albums. So, it's safe to say that she has $1 million at least in her bank, and Lauren's net worth is expected to rise in near future. With that, we have come to an end of this video. What are your thoughts on Lauren Allred? Let us know in the comments section below. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you in the next video.